I'd like to think that I'm just a pretty regular human being. I go through a lot of emotions at times. One of those emotions is anger. God talks about righteous anger about things. I hate the things that God hates. I'm never trying to judge people unfairly on this channel. I point out signs, symbols, and agendas that are clearly antichrist. They have to do with Freemasonry or other secret societies. I'm not going to sit here and pretend that I, I like it. I forgive these people. I want them to go to heaven, but I don't like it. And it always reminds me of 1 John 2.15. Love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. Remember, God is love. That's for sure. He loves us. He loves us despite being sinners, right? If we were yet still sinners, he loved us first. I love the people on this channel. I want them to go to heaven, but I want them to repent of their ways and to, you know, make an effort in this world that is so fallen and so sold out. It can become very depressing if you focus on it too much. I know this channel can maybe do that, but I try and balance it. I, I don't, I don't want to like be too negative on this channel about the people that we feature here every day. So this scripture is important to me. I believe this scripture, I believe all scripture to be the word of God. Frank Turner is a singer songwriter. Can we all see that he's clearly doing one eye symbolism here? Holding up a record to darken one of his eyes, doing the eye of Horus, one eye symbolism. This is what sellouts do. Oh, but they have fame, fortune, and success in this fallen world. Who cares? Who cares? Do these people really think that's worth more than eternal salvation and going to heaven to walk with Jesus Christ, pick up our cross daily? This is disgusting and stupid. I can't believe so many people are like this. And this is where, right, I'm a little angry today. Jesus Christ knows my mission. He knows what I'm doing. He knows that I'm trying to help open people's eyes. I'm not trying to be full of myself, that's for sure. I want to help people by showing them clear, although hidden in plain sight, signs, symbols, and agendas that are antichrist. These are not for Christ, so if you are not for Christ, by default, you are against him. Frank Turner, the musician, is doing one-eye symbolism here. I wonder why. People that don't believe in the finished work of Jesus Christ and have salvation, they should be worried about this. The end is coming. The end is coming soon. A lot of Christians differ on the Bible. We don't all agree on scripture. We don't all agree on the rapture and what takes place. But one day soon, Christians will be with the Lord forever. He will not leave or forsake us. I want that for the world, but the world doesn't seem to want that right now. Like they want this life, living their best life now, fame, fortune, and success. Oh my goodness, what a great thing. When you find out what the world is, I'm, I'm sorry, but it should it should peeve you off. I don't want to swear. God doesn't want us to swear. Clean water should not go with dirty water. So you don't want dirty water coming out of your mouth. That's true. This is in, in the Bible. I'm not quoting it verse by verse, but you know what I mean. The end is coming soon. Well, I hope everyone's ready. You know, I worry about salvation sometimes, but I have faith 100%. In Jesus Christ, his death, burial, and resurrection. Jesus is God in the flesh, fully man, fully God, dying on the cross for us. This is the most important thing. Without that, we have nothing. But he did do that. God loves us. That doesn't mean everything goes. That doesn't mean you can mock him. That doesn't mean you can be a Freemason or any other secret society thing. So again, I sound a little peeved today because I am. Like So many people don't understand this. My family doesn't understand what I'm doing. And that saddens me because I'm trying to make, you know, make some kind of change in the world. It's nothing to do with me per se, but I have a YouTube channel with some followers. I'm one small voice and I always say that I couldn't do this without you, brothers and sisters. This is our channel. It's part of the truth community. It's part of the Christian community because even though a lot of people say, I'm a Christian, look at me. 
A lot of people are not Christians that claim to be. A lot of people say, I believe in God, but they don't believe in the true God. They make up God in their head or make up a version of God that doesn't exist. The end is coming. And to top it all off, here's some artwork of Frank Turner doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra. You know that gesture we see every day for years. That is definitely something and not nothing. This is supposed to represent supreme enlightenment. It is far from it. It's embarrassing that these people pose like this. I feel sad for them. I really do. It is so stupid. It is so full of pride and ego that, go ahead, do this pose. Is that going to get you into heaven, Frank Turner? Because no, it's not. I'm not just picking on Frank Turner here. I've never even heard his music. Some people will say, oh, what are you talking about then? Never even heard his music? Why do I need to? Um, if you're not paying attention, he's covering one of his eyes. He's mocking the end times and he's doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra. Oh, well, let me go listen to his pleasant music then. No, thanks. So many people in this world are sold out to Satan. And it's even worse because they keep it a vow of silence. They keep the secret about it. They're involved in Freemasonry or other things. This is ridiculous. I cannot believe so much of the world is on the big, broad, open path. The narrow path is for truth. The narrow path is for heaven. The narrow path is what we should be on. But, hey, fame, fortune, success for a hundred years. Most likely not even a hundred years because not everyone lives to a hundred. No one's guaranteed their next breath. No one's guaranteed tomorrow. So I turn this video into a bit of a rant, but... I may be angry in this video, but I do not hate these people. Like I said, I want them to go to heaven, but I want them to come out of deception. I want them to knock off the signs, symbols, and agendas that are clearly seen on this channel and other channels that expose darkness, reprove darkness. Well, I hope everyone's enjoying life because life is short. You're not guaranteed tomorrow. Jesus Christ is the way, the truth, the life for everyone, but a lot of people don't choose that. They choose this instead. Brothers and sisters, everyone else, God bless you.